representatives from the Fox Valley. We have Fox Valley Metro, Outagamie County Sheriff's, and St. Joseph's. We're talking about arresting hunger. Love this challenge. Start off by explaining it for us. Yeah, it's a, it's a really unique kind of collaboration that we got uh, together a few months ago, or about a month ago now, and, and really you know, partnering with St. Joe's and coming together as law enforcement across the valley has been really, really special. And you guys are collecting different things each month. So tell us what we're starting with this month. This month we're starting with peanut butter. Uh, each month we're going to have a different staple food for mm -hmm. four months. And then collectively, we're going to see which department can collect the most, and then we're going to get all that over to St. Joe's. And I hear Outagamie County Sheriff had quite, quite a haul today. We did, we did. We had a uh, special jeans day for our employees, mm -hmm. and what that allowed was for employees to bring in peanut butter for us. And we collected 700 pounds of peanut butter last week. That is incredible. Uh, so we dropped that off today. We were very 700 excited. 700 pounds. Can you tell us what this does for the food pitch? I mean, 700 yeah. pounds. Yeah, 700 pounds. I mean, it's uh, we tend to hand out close to 2,000 jars of peanut butter per month. Um, so 12 to 16 ounce jars of peanut butter. So something at 16 ounces, about 700. I mean, it really gets us through almost a whole month right there of our distribution, over half at least of our distribution of peanut butter per month. So it just shows you 700 peanut butter jars can make a big difference. And it's just something as simple as peanut butter. Can you talk about the need for food in the Fox Valley? Yeah, I mean, it's something we talked about on the way up here where the Fox Valley we're very fortunate where it might not be starvation as we see on a world sure, level, sure. but there's definitely some food concerns here in the, in the valley. And if we can, uh, you know, just help give a little bit of food to families that need it each week, uh, hopefully they can spend some money maybe on, on rent or gas mm -hmm. or something for the children, you know, something to ease the burden of the actual cost of living every day on something as simple as some food that you know we have here in our community. We have a great community. Mm -hmm. uh, we've been doing it 35 years, St. Joe's in the community, and we wouldn't do it without uh, partnerships from everybody, including you know law enforcement. So can, it's wonderful. Can you talk about what, I mean, this friendly competition, but it is a competition, right? Oh, no <laughs> doubt, absolutely. I, although it, it's all for a good cause, but it is fun to have a little healthy banter between our uh, counterparts at other agencies. So it's been really fun uh, you know, to have these competitions going, to kind of have some banter back and forth on social media. It's been uh, quite the quite the month. And that's just it. Different, different agencies are posting things, pictures, videos, <laughs> things like that. What do you hear from your deputies and things? Do you, do you think that they're, they're liking this competition? Well, I think all of our employees are really getting into it. It's, it's a nice way to help the community. Mm -hmm. It's great to have a healthy competition between agencies. We want something to challenge each other, to try and make each other better. And in this case, we're helping the community, and that's huge. What is it like? You know, you're out there every single day on the streets. What is our Fox Valley community like? We have such a wonderful community. Mm -hmm. It's such a nicely well-rounded community. Mm -hmm. Everybody wants to help out and pitch in. Uh, in this case, we're just finding another way, a creative way to do it. And it's an absolutely wonderful way, like you guys said. Thank you so much for being with us. Again, let's take a look at those items for each month because they're all different. January, of course, is peanut butter. February is jam and jelly. March is tuna fish. April, pastas and sauces. For more information about this competition, just visit our website.